Hey everybody, it's Heather. Um, today I will re be reviewing a uh, coffee mug by CBT Wear. So let's go ahead and get this beauty opened up and see what it looks like. So this is what it looks like in the package. Comes with a little bit of bubble wrap. No other extra packaging things in there, but it does look like it held up pretty well in shipping. There's no nicks or crannies or anything. It's a smaller coffee mug than what I'm normally used to. But it says don't be a prick and has a lot of um, cactuses on here. So that's really cute. Really like that. Love cactuses. Um, it is made in China. Fairly well weighted. It's more of like an off, like an eggshell or off-white color. Uh, on the video, it looks brighter than what it is, but it's actually a little bit of a dimmer color. Uh, details really good. I really, really, really love cactuses. That's why I wanted this one to try out and see about doing a review on about it because, like I said, I'm obsessed with cactuses. So I have my coffee maker over here ready to go. I'm not actually going to make coffee tonight because uh, I am doing this video at night. I'm actually going to put hot water into it because I want to see, you know, how it holds up to my normal hot water that comes out of my coffee maker. And we'll just do this size here and we'll see how much it pops out. It's making lots and lots of noises. Ooh, look at all that steam. Makes me actually want a coffee. But I need to go get creamer. I am a blonde coffee drinker. I don't like dark, I don't like black coffee or coffee with just sugar. I actually like flavored coffee creamer. <laughs> so I get like uh, hazelnut. It's probably my favorite. But I do like the holiday flavors they come out with around this year. I think my favorite that I tried was like pumpkin and then peppermint. But alright, so. We're completed, checking it out, making sure there's no little cracks that opened up since this was cold whenever I did it. Um, it is very hot to the touch, so you definitely don't want to touch the side of the mug unless you have a little thing to go on it, but then that kind of takes away from the don't be a prick part of it. But I don't see any stress factor um, fractures or anything like that, so that's really good. Turn that off because it makes a lot of noises. So I'm going to dump this out real quick and check out the inside of it real fast. So like I said, it's really good. I don't see any fractures happening. Just a bunch of water. Uh, yeah, I like it. <laughs> I mean, you can like go to your office meeting and if you don't like somebody that's in there, just stare at them the whole time while you're drinking out of your coffee so they know that you're thinking about them when you drink out of it. Um, you know, it's a cute little display. If you're like me, I have a bunch of like little themed cups. So sometimes I like to just like display them on the counter. So here's a comparison. This is my normal coffee cup here. Here's this one. Um, I would have to make the smaller option to be able to put my creamer in here to get it the way that I like compared to the uh, medium option for my bigger cup. So uh, I forget what size this one is. I don't think this one has a size on it because uh, I also forget what size this little <laughs> don't be prick one is. But overall, really cute, really like it. Um, probably going to be hand washed only just because you don't want to accidentally... Um, blast off any of this paint in the uh, washing machine. So yeah, overall, I like it.